Hello, you lovely lot. Happy Friday. Well, to be fair, I've had happier Fridays. So I'm injured. And if you know me, that's not good because I'm a very active person, very busy. My life's hectic. I'm all over the place doing all sorts of things all the time. So this has put me in a difficult place but it's also made me very reflective. So for this week's video, I wanted to talk a little bit about gratitude, about taking our rest as seriously as we take our hustle and a bit of mindfulness. So as I say, gratitude is my first point in today's video. Not having the use of my foot, which is injured, has made me realize just how incredibly lucky I was when my foot was fully able and working. Um, and it's made me realize I won't take my body and my health for granted again, because it's my tool. It gets me through every day. You know, the smallest things. It's difficult for me to shower. I can't stand in the shower. I'm so grateful for all the times that my feet have carried me and stood me in the shower. Um, so definitely make me reflect on times. Um, and as I say, just take that little bit of gratitude. So I think it's important in line with that to take our rest as seriously as we take our hustle. I am a self-confessed workaholic. Um, I really like dive into projects and it's my way of dealing with things to be honest it's always been how I've kind of distracted myself some people like to watch tv and um, some people get lost in a book I can kind of do those things but I get much more lost in work stuff so being injured it teaches me that you need to listen to your body when it's whispering otherwise you'll be forced to listen to it when it screams and right now my foot is screaming at me because i didn't take rest seriously enough so in this video for once i'm not encouraging you to exercise i mean i am i'm always encouraging you to keep healthy and live an active lifestyle but as a massive 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 part of that i'm encouraging you to get sufficient high quality rest when you need it if i bring out a video one day and you're not feeling up to it don't force it if your body's telling you that you need to chill and take some time please take that time i really you know i want to be inspiring for people in terms of as i say keeping healthy and being active but a big part of that is resting and giving your body time to recover. Otherwise you end up ill and injured, which we don't want. I'm speaking from personal experience. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to talk about gratitude, taking time out to just have a think and be grateful for our bodies and the fact that they allow us to exercise and dance and move all the time. Thank you. Um, and then also just reflecting on the fact that rest is super, super important. Um, and you know, the same way I kind of schedule in all of these meetings and workshops and videos and what have you, I need to schedule in that time for me and for my body to recover from everything that I put it through. So this video is to encourage you to do the same. And then also I did want to touch on a bit of mindfulness. So having to sit still for long periods of time is really difficult for me, um, as I've mentioned. And if you can't tell already, it's made me really reflective and given me time to think. Um, and I find it difficult to get that bit of escapism and kind of take my mind away from everything that's going on. So I found that focusing on my breathing has really, really helped with my anxiety and managing all of the things that are constantly buzzing around in my head. Um, I think it's worsened because I'm stuck in my bed and I can't do all of the things that I need to do. So I just want to do a little bit of breathing to finish off the video together. Um, yeah, let's give it a go. So gonna put on a little bit of hands on our belly and we're gonna think about that idea of a balloon inflating and deflating and we're just gonna take this moment to be really present and mindful of how our body feels we're gonna listen to what it's telling us we're gonna breathe in we're gonna hold hold it there and release good and again, nice big deep breath in, filling up that balloon. Hold. 
and we're gonna release. Good, once more this time, when we're breathing in, we're gonna think about all of the positive things that we wanna manifest, all that we're grateful for, our bodies included, for carrying us over all these weeks of exercise. And when we breathe out, we're gonna release everything negative that no longer serves us, um, that we need to let go of. So, breathing in together. Holding. And releasing. Hands are gonna go on our knees and we're just gonna take a moment to do a few more breaths. And again, just be really aware of our bodies. Where do we feel tension? Is there pain anywhere? Where are we holding stress? Is it in our neck, in our shoulders? All right, breathing in. guys thank you so much for joining i'm sure today was not what you had anticipated i'm usually here making you sweat but this week i'm encouraging quite the opposite um, and i think it's an important reminder to listen to our bodies and um, to take our rest as seriously as we take our hustle um, and ensure that we have longevity you know in our careers in our active lifestyles if we don't listen when we're injured and do what we need to do or when we're ill if we don't take the appropriate rest we're gonna pay for it i'm paying for it <laughs> hopefully next week i'll be a lot more active and i look forward to seeing you then bye